My name is Josh. I am a board game tester for Zatu Games. I am here with Hannah. Hello. She, I will be showing her this game. She has never played it before. And it's one of my personal favourites, Isla Sky. It's to do with Scotland and building your empire. Well, with that done, let's get started. We have played this game before, so it won't be set out how it usually would be in the box. I have got this, the, this bag. I'll tell you what that does in a minute. Okay. These balls, eh, I don't need them. And a scoreboard. Right. Um, so, the scoreboard counts points. It also has whip, um, what we are doing basically here and some amount of coins. These are representing what colour you are. Can we choose our colours now? Yes, pick a colour, any colour. Come on now, pick a colour. Can I be yellow, please? Yes, but do, let do. Thank I'm you. I'm going to green, dark green preferably, because it's my favourite colour. So what do we do with the others? So Just put them aside? Will, with the others, I will put them to a side. Okay. Now, I will get out these parts. Now, this part, I only get out two of them because we only need two of them each. Now, this is like a little shelter. So the other mm. person doesn't see what I will show in a minute. Okay. Next, I'll show the windows. There are many windows to pick from. You don't get to pick, though. There's many windows in choice. You, when you... When we're set, since we're setting up, these will be face down. You'll grab a few, shuffle them. Sorry, I dropped that. Um, and then pick some. Hannah, would you like to pick two? I will pick another two. Okay, and they've got to go on yes. here? Okay, you so I'll pick two. A and C. Do A and okay. C. And I can put them straight down on the board? A and C, yeah. And now I'm yep. going to pick this one and that one for okay. B and D. I will get to the main cards. This is where the bag comes in. You'll put these cards in your bag. You'll pick three every turn. And I'll now bring in the axe. So you'll keep these hidden behind your shelter. Let me just do an example for you. Um, your partner wouldn't be able to see this. So, there's my thing. Here's my shelter. There's my things. Since it's um, the first turn, we're focusing on having that, a lighthouse, a boat, and a concealed water source. So, here we have a lighthouse, boats. So, you can also look further ahead in the game what we'll need. Since that's got lighthouse and boat signs on, I'll take that. And I'll also take this because it's got this because it's got quite a bit of water. The axe comes in handy for getting rid of things. At the start, you will collect five coins in whatever currency you like. Okay. I like picking usually two of these and one there. Oh, that's what I've got. So, you'll then choose how much you want to, how much, if somebody was going to buy yours, how much it would be. Since this one I like, because it's got a lighthouse, which we need, and boat, and you get one point for getting two boats, and we need boats, I would go for about £3. You want to have a little bit of money left, because you want to buy other people's. I'll get into that later. So I'm actually going to take that off and put that that there and keep one to myself. So that was a little example. Then we'll open it up. Hannah would open hers up if she had one. You will put it like that and get rid of that. You will just put it in the lid. So that's the that's one that I you do. axed to get rid of. So, okay. Then 
Um, so if Hannah had an E, then if she had one I wanted to buy, for one, I would buy it. I would give her that and take the token and add it onto here. So say I bought this token from her, I would then put this on. You couldn't do that. I will tell you why now. You, it has to be on the same water type it is. So I could do that because it's water on water. I could do that because it's a mountain on mountain. Or I could do that or that. I would quite like to do that if I did this. So now that's enough for this example. I will now bring out the rest of the money. So this piece is who starts. Usually the most youngish would start. Since, also since Anna's new to this game, I'll start too. Okay. So I'll put that counter next to me. I would hide my stuff and keep my axe here. So I will now take five in currency. But let's first just finish off putting these coins over here in the pile. So, let's get started now, fully on. I will take three cards blindly from this bag. Blindly, you said? <laughs> yeah, because, yeah, I was just looking at how many times. So okay. now Hannah should not be able to see these. And if you can, just don't look. I'll do that again. <laughs> So when Hannah is ready, she will reveal. I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> so, I have two gold on this card. I have axed this card. But we do need that stuff because I would like to save these barrels I had. I put two gold, again, on this card. Anna, you can now show your cards. Okay, so I axed this card. I didn't want to keep this one. Where do they go? In, not in the bag? No, just, no, just in the box, they're not in use. I put two coins on this card with a barrel. And I have a barrel on this card, which I gave one coin to. So what now, Josh? So now, I will go first since I've got the Piper player. Mm. I will now choose if, with my one penny <laughs> if I can buy anything from yours. I can buy this, so I will. So now, you take. have two gold and that two gold to mm -hmm. buy what you want from me. You can okay. only buy one card. Right. And you can't buy both. If even, I have enough even, money. Even if you have enough money, you still can't buy it. So I'm looking at here, on here, on I, to see what we need to you. collect. That's what have you got? I've got, um, so let me just ex explain these. If you have an ox, I think it is, um, walking around, if you can clearly see it on there, I'll show you one later in the game, then you'll get one point for him. And we'll score it on the point board. So, and on this one, there's just a barrel. But what are we trying to accomplish on this you, first game? Yes, yeah, so on the first round, since it's only A, you want to accomplish this. You want to get one lighthouse, one boat, and a concealed water area. So, this would be a concealed water area. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm not doing that. Because I need to connect this barrel to make sure it does count money. Okay. So I'm going and, to... But you don't have to buy, by the way. You don't have to. I'm going to buy this one from you, please. Okay, that'll be two pound. Two pound. Thank you very much. I meant two million pound. <laughs> <laughs> so then I join that to my empire. Yes. So, so I'm putting the water. Okay. If so, nobody bought a card, so nobody bought my card. You would keep the card, but get rid of the money. Keep the card, but get rid of the money. Yes. So this one goes back into the bank. 
So I have now got two of them coins. Okay. I'm going to attach this. So, are you ready? Um, I just need to attach my last tile. Okay. We'll now get, now we'll get our income. So you get five for every, for your castle. Okay. You five for your castle and any currency you like. Two, two and a one. And you'll get, and if there's barrels connected to your castle, this one is, but this one isn't. So you get one extra coin. One coin because and the I barrel. And I get two extra coins because that's joined. So okay. I've now got two of these. Two of these. And one of them. All together I have, three. that's a two basically. So two, four, six. I have 11 pound here. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight pound. This token, this lovely Piperman flyer, will go to Hannah now. So I start. Yes. So take two, three. Three tiles? Yes. Not allowed to look? One, two, three. Okay, I've got three. Now your turn. One, two, three. Three is an unlucky number. <laughs> One, two, three. Clearly, yes. So, Hannah, are you ready to reveal? I am. I will now reveal. I asked a barrel and two sheeps. Sheepies. Because I'm looking ahead in the game. This is A and C, and I'm looking back to A. So I was getting some water areas and some boats, because you need them. Ah, oh, you're thinking So ahead. I got this. And this. This one has one of these. So every castle, every like barrack things you have, you get one point. So. You can try and buy mine, Hannah. Okay. So, I've got two on here, so that'll be four, two twos, and two twos on here, so that'll be four. So, four pound each. You can't afford, it isn't now my cut. <laughs> I only have two pound left. I've got three pound. So, I can't I can buy any of any yours. Of, I can afford both of yours. Oh, that's axed. Should I put that back in the box? I will buy this one. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Okay. So, I now move that to the side, move that to the side, and get rid of all of that precious money. <laughs> bye bye. So, I will now add these three tokens on. This is the one I just bought from Hannah. Do you need this person now because you're yes, starting? Yes, I'm starting. Okay. I've got the pipe player. Lucky dip. One. You can see what she got. <laughs> no, you'll never see it. Have you picked yours? I have. Well, now let's get to sorting, basically. Open up. I'm maxing hmm? this stupid old tire. And I make sure to show yours. Four, mm -hmm. four pound. I've got this tile. Can I see? <gasps> it has a boat on it. And no, but that's what I'm going to keep because I've got this. Oh. That's the main part I get. It. And three pound I've got this. I've got no money left, so it is your go immediately. Mm. Okay, so I've axed that one. I don't want that tile. Thank you. Three bar bar sheep. And this tile is for three pound. And this tile's for well, four. Well, that's going to all go into the bin. Anyway, because I can't buy anything, so I'll go. Oh, so yeah. I've got no money. So, what would I like to buy? Oh, darn, you've got enough to 
find the one I really <laughs> Can I buy the boat, please? Yeah. How much does it cost? I kind of don't. Four pound. Two, I kind of don't need four. that really as much as I need the other one. Thank you. this one has got a lighthouse on. And that's all I need to complete. And that's what pay. you need. Oh, okay. Good thinking. That's so good. this money goes And I've now got another area. Well done. Let me join this up to mine. Now at the end of the game, we'll add up the rest of our points. And, um, yeah. We'll see who's see who won. Wins. I reckon. I'm a beginner. Pause the video here and put in the comment section down below who do you think will win. Okay, let's get started there. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Now the champion will do a victory dance. Since the champion mm. is me, I will do my victory dance and you have to do a loser dance. <laughs> I'm just a learner, Josh. What do you expect? Tough. Very good teacher, though. Da 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 I don't know if I'm doing a loser dance. I don't think I want to. <laughs> Tough. Well, I enjoyed this game a lot. Thoroughly, especially with Hannah here. My Aww. favourite points of the game are, it's to do with money. I love money games and I love games which I, c which I have to think, mm. use that mind. Don't, because you need to dust it every now and again. If you don't dust it, it will go squidgy and it will be not usable. Okay. That's what I like about this You game. like it. I like this game. In fact, I've never played it before. It's quite interesting. There's quite a lot to learn, a lot of aspects to it. But I think with another couple of rounds, I think um, I might be a potential winner. And how many players can you have on this game? Up to... Up to five. Well, thank you for watching. Make sure to watch other videos of us either doing board games, playing them, or you know what I mean. So, and make sure to subscribe, so yeah, thank you for watching.